it is pouring. So we might be going home. <laughs> Good afternoon, Mosiers. It is Monday, June 27th, and we just got home from our Disney trip last night, and we're about to embark on another Southern Mosey adventure. Um, today, we are going to be going to the North Carolina Zoo. Um, Bryson's very excited. Uh, we've been here many times. We live fairly close within the area. Um, it is in Asheboro, North Carolina. Why, you might ask, are we planning on going to spend a whole day walking around the zoo after we just got back from Disney? Well, we've got some cousins visiting. Um, and while they're here, we've decided to spend the day enjoying the zoo. If you live within two, three hours of this zoo, it is worth the day trip. This is probably the best zoo I have ever been to. Um, and I've been to several. I've even been to the Zoo of Atlanta. And honestly, this one's my favorite. Um, they do a great job here. The exhibits are really well done. Um, it is definitely worth the day trip. Um, so let's go in and get this adventure started. May I just say that this is the emptiest I have seen this parking lot, like ever. So Monday may be a great day to go. I don't know if you can see that parking lot there, completely empty. So awesome. Here it is. There's your cousins. North America. All right, I'm going to introduce Bryson's cousins. I'm going to go from youngest to smallest. So we have Colton. Say hey, Colton. Good job. We have Caleb. And Caden. And Chloe. And they're joining us on our zoo adventure today. Right, Bryson? Yeah. Crocodile. It's crocodile. It's an alligator. I'll write that crocodile. It's an alligator. Look at Bakey, he's chilling. He kind of hurt his feelings, man. people can like snakes because that is the face of pure evil. <laughs> the neighbor. Thank you, Toad. Look at him. Hello. many times and here's a tip for you park in North America hop on the tram and take it to the center and then do Africa because Africa is a loop and then when you get back it's just a walk back to your car North America is long so it's a long trick trek but you get back to the center and then you can walk back to your car and that is the best way to see the entire zoo the easiest way Ha, 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 ha. 
Again? Oh, there's one on your head. Again? Yeah, it's just sitting on your hat. Again? <laughs> <laughs> Is one on my head too? No. Is there one on my head? It's still sitting there. He's just chilling. He likes to be Ooh. Look how many are up here. there. You are. They like landing on you. Maybe it's your red shirt. Your bright red shirt. They think you're a flower. How does the gray and black look like a flower? I don't know. Maybe you just have a very pretty flower face. Yeah, Kev, Kev, knock out the window. No, don't knock on the window. Yeah. I want to see the Willard's face. Yeah, the brains are one of He's like, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, darling. Oh, he's new. Here's the big guy. Like Epcot and like Animal Kingdom, today is turning out to be a bus. I don't know if you can see the rain. That is pouring. So we might be going home. Okay, so we only saw half of Africa, but it's raining and nasty, so we're gonna call it a day, right guys? We didn't see a whole lot. What was your favorite animal that we saw? The lemurs are very cool. I've actually never seen the lemurs out before, and I've been here many times. So you need to come on a cool day if you want to see those. Um, but you've got a lot of good chimpanzee action today. They were moving around. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so I will look and see if I can find old zoo pictures and stuff to so finish out this video. But yeah, raining. Don't come when it rains, but come when it's cool.
sea lion? Or a seal? He's like, he's like, what's up, guys? What's up? Oh, oh, oh. He's throwing them food. if you're ever in the Asheboro area, this truly is a remarkable zoo. Uh, I, my suggestion is to not come in the rain because it's hard to see things, but to come when it's cooler because uh, the animals are usually more out and, and playing. So we got on the tram. We decided we we're just going to call a day, go home. But then by the time we got off the tram back in North America, it wasn't raining anymore. So we're like, oh, the polar bears are right here. Let's go try to see if we can see them. So we did get to fit in. We saw the seals real quick. We saw the puffin birds real quick, which puffin bird is my favorite animal. I think they're adorable. And then we went and we saw um, the polar bear. We sat in their exhibit forever because it was shaded, it was sheltered, and it was started pouring down rain as soon as we got in there. And we waited. We saw maybe we will see a polar bear. We we're trying to wait out the rain, and uh, we didn't. And then the rain stops. So we're like, okay, let's just try to get back to the car. And as we were leaving, and we got to the top part of the exhibit, the polar bear was standing out there. So we did get to see the polar bear. So that was awesome. Um, I will see if I can put in any old pictures of us having fun at the zoo because we've lived here for many years. Um, within the area we're fairly close and um, I'll try to put some of those old pictures in there it's great great zoo um, if you're two like I said two to three hours it's worth a day trip if you're not there is a campground in this area right here called Zooland. I don't know if I can recommend it yet we're gonna do that this summer and I'm really excited so that video will be coming soon hopefully it'll be great it's got great reviews um, but that's all I got for you today so please like and subscribe and mosey on <laughs> Not picking his nose. Uh -oh.